<laughs> wow. And then mm -hmm. he drops all the coffee everywhere and Don freaked out. It what? was so funny. I would... <laughs> Jesse? Hey, Dad. Jesse, what are you doing here? I thought you were supposed to be at work today. Yeah, I got fired. What? What? Peggy gave you that job as a favor to me. What happened? She said I was late too many times. You know I'm not a morning person. Oh, Jesse. <laughs> it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. You know, my friend went out on a limb to get you that job. You dropped out of college. You've been fired from the last five jobs you've had, and it's only been three months. It's really not that serious. Oh, it's not that serious? You sit around here on your phone all day, ticking and talking, or whatever you're doing. I will get another job. <laughs> but not tonight. Tomorrow. <laughs> tonight I'm going to the movies with my friends. <gasps> Dad, can I have some money? No! What? Okay, look, Jesse. You're our daughter, and we love you. You always have a home here. But you need to start taking life way more serious. We're not gonna keep paying your way. Oh my gosh, Dad, can you please? No, I'm sorry, honey. But sooner or later, you are gonna have to learn how to start taking things more seriously. You know, maybe you should start paying rent around here. Dad, what is she talking about? Please, can you talk to her? She, she's not making any sense. Sweetie, look, I'm sorry. I think your mother's right. Look, I can help you. Oh my God. I you know what? I don't need either of you. I have friends who care way more about me than you do. I think I'm gonna just go stay with them. Me and my phone. Great. Not exactly how I wanted that to go. Don't you think you were a little hard on her? <laughs> don't you think you were a little soft on her? Everything's my fault. In the Bermuda Triangle. Thanks, Destiny. I'm Lizzie Blihar. And I'm Sam Blihar. And, and thanks, thanks for watching Conspiracy, Conspiracy Central. Jesse. Hi, Dad. Oh, Jesse. Honey. <sighs> We've been so worried about you. I know. I'm so sorry for the way that I left, but I'm almost glad that I did it. What do you mean, sweetie? Well, after I left, I stayed on a friend's sofa for a few days, but she kicked me out when she realized that I was just using her for a place to stay. I didn't want to tell you guys, and I had nowhere else to go, so I ended up sleeping on the street. What? But oh I only slept on the streets one night, and I realized how far I'd fallen. I let everyone down, including myself. So the first thing I did was I went back to Peggy and I apologized. And I asked for my job back, and she gave it to me. I also asked her if she knew about any apartments, and she happened to know somebody who needed a roommate. Oh my so. God. <laughs> how come she didn't tell us about this? Because I begged her not to. I had to prove it to myself before I proved it to you guys. She even asked me if I wanted to be a manager. That's great news, oh. sweetie. Yeah. But I said no. Why? Because I am gonna go back to school. And this time, I'm not gonna be fooling oh. around and partying. Yes. I am going to go to all of my classes and I'm gonna graduate. <gasps> Honey, we are so proud of you. This is a great decision. Thank you, Mom. Thanks, Dad. I'm never going to let you down like this ever again. Get in here. What are you doing out there? <laughs> I'm so proud of you. <laughs> <laughs>